My name, I think, is Alfie Spencer. I think I work at a place called Flamingo, and I am a commercial semiotician. It is to help build brands that have more cultural traction and more power in their social circumstances and context. I'm basically a geeky commitment to watching a huge amount of advertising um, and being quite opinionated about it. Um, at a junior level, I mean, practical experience I don't think really comes into it. I think as an industry we sort of fetishize this idea that people have already done the thing that you are hiring them to do and I just don't think that's necessary. Um, I think they have to be extremely engaged with the idea that the world is quite a strange place and it's worth looking twice at what things are because they normally turn out to be a bit more weird than you originally think they should be. Um, it's so tiny that that's, I mean, it's, it's almost, I mean, it's a cottage industry. So we have, we have plenty of people who want to do it. Um, I'd like it if more people wanted to do it. And I think lots of people do want to do it, they just don't know it exists, um, is my main problem. And, and obviously clients are buying it a lot now, so we, we are always looking for people. Um, it depends what level, mostly at universities, um, people in graduate study programs in, in art, in, in literary, literary studies, um, in cultural studies, uh, in anthropology programs, it really just depends. Um, I think often it's a strange combination of someone who's quite kind of geeky and uncool but likes kind of finding out uh, or thinking about very, very new things um, and that's often quite a strange combination of skills. I always tell people that the thing they should do is run a blog just writing general cultural criticism because um, it gets you in the habit of writing for an audience about advertising, about um, art, about literature about things that are happening, broader cultural experiences and I think if you get into the habit of writing about those things you tend to be much clearer about exactly what you mean when you when you talk about them. One of the you know real issues that you can find early on is that people know how to analyze things one way or another but they don't know what's interesting about their own views and I think finding an audience is um, often the most important thing actually. Um, give them space People are generally pretty curious and engaged so long as you don't stop them. And uh, I think the great danger is that you tell people what to do. Uh, the best thing to do is just let people experiment and these things kind of happen, hopefully. <laughs> Source LF are London's leading creative communications and media recruitment agency. Be sure to like our video and subscribe to this channel. Take the moment to watch another of our videos on screen now.